Only on two now, outrage from the family of a murdered South Chicago woman. A man charged for her killing is set to be released on his own recognizance because his case was not brought to trial fast enough. CBS 2 Suzanne Lemagneau has the family's heartbreak. It was pretty hurtful. It was um, definitely something that we were not expecting. Ebony Peel talks about the impending release of Drew Carter III in the kidnapping and murder case involving her sister-in-law, Jessica Flores. Carter is awaiting trial in Flores' murder. This is my sister, Jessica Flores. The mother... That's who she was dating. Shameful. Case That's just involving her sister these people. <laughs> In law, Jessica Flores. Carter is awaiting trial in Flores' murder. This is my sister, Jessica Flores. The mother of six was reported missing in February of 2019. Her partial skeletal remains were found in a Gary, Indiana forest preserve in April of 2020. It's infuriating, you know, because he's worried about his constitutional rights or, you know, his he's worried about himself when at the end of the day, he took all of my sister-in-law's rights away. Carter has been in custody for Flores' murder since March of 2019. Under criminal rule four in Indiana law, a defendant in custody has the right to a speedy trial within 180 days. If that doesn't happen, the defendant can be released on their own. Wow. I mean, shit. What a great country. I mean, a great country. the fact that this guy would bitch about this country. He doesn't say the since charges since are dropped, but just yeah. because he has the right to be released. Yeah, the fact that he Which was is huge, about, though. But that's huge, Johnny. Yeah, it's just, it's just crazy. Not many people actually get a trial within 180 days of a major crime like that. That's and that is just rare. fucking uh, backlog yeah. that the courts are in. It's yeah, days just the appeals and appearances is y'all usually a, a year for a murder case, or oh, close to a yeah, at least a year or yeah. Yeah, exactly, exactly. That was a veteran move on his part. Yeah, it's, it's, that's why I be scared of these dudes. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I mean some sun men are geniuses on things like this. Um. <laughs> No, I'm serious. Well, they're, yeah, they're, yeah. they're 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 Einsteins on things like this. Well, well look at this guy. Look at this picture, man. I think we could all take an educated guess that his rap sheet is like a CVS receipt, right? Cool. Look at him. Three of them. Three Come on, CVS man. receipts. Come on. He he's gonna he's gonna cure cancer while he's out on on no bond. <laughs> he is a cancer. <laughs> Yo, this is crazy, man. I mean, you don't. You, you don't have to be that smart. He just has to have a good uh, public defender, lawyer. a good lawyer. Yeah. Yeah. He, he, he's, um, he's the type of guy that literally is dating these fine-ass women in, in D.C. and all the cities that I've lived in. Like, th this guy, he's getting – he's winning out here in this, this game you call date. You know how people say the dating game is just so rough in such and such city. I hate <laughs> dating in Atlanta. I hate dating in DC. Right. Can't find anybody. So he's not this in the master guy, act. This guy, no, no, he's he doesn't know any of those guys. He he's never heard of Kevin Samuels. He'd probably be like, "Who is that? Who he play for?" If you said Kevin Samuels, he would say, "Who does he <laughs> right. play for?" Or, or what that he from? Yeah, he doesn't know any of those guys. He doesn't have time. For that he's too, <laughs> doing, he's too busy doing mulatto beauties and shit. Yeah, he's too not busy paying, he's not he's paying crazy. for anything. Yeah, not paying for anything. He's he not paying for anything. Shoes, no, no, no. clothes, food, nothing. Right. And then he goes to jail and the same shit. He's not paying for anything. Yeah. And then he comes yeah. out and still not paying for anything. Nope. We're talking about a straight up straight up winner like you can say you can sit here and say you can sit here and say um uh like oh yeah you're a loser or something like that no my man is a oh he's a loser my man is a winner he's a winner he won okay he's won 
We talking about somebody who's living the American dream. <laughs> okay. He, he's a perfect candidate to be sent back, Chief. Like put he's he would be first on the boat if you if I had the fun to do it. Yeah, but first like I was saying, all the sun women and mulattoes and sisters would beat you up for him and drag him off the boat. They could go with him. <laughs> They could go. They could be right there with him, and that's what they want to do. Look, I mean, I right, no solutions. Shit, none. Before Flores's murder since March of 2019, under Criminal Rule Four in Indiana law, a defendant in custody has the right to a speedy trial within 180 days. If that doesn't happen, the defendant can be released on their own recognizance while awaiting trial, which is what is happening now in Carter's case. Just the fact that he can pull this card and I guess, quote unquote, live a normal life on the streets and go home to his family. Like there's that's not fair. That's not justice. One of Carter's attorneys told us Mr. Carter has maintained his innocence. His case was set for trial in September of 2019. His attorneys were ready to defend him. The state of Indiana filed a motion to dismiss the case two weeks before it was supposed to go to trial and then subsequently decided to refile the case this fall. It's just really disappointing that our judicial system is failing again. Suzanne Lemonio, CBS 2 News. I mean, I, he's, that I, dick I, is, is demanding criminal justice reform, too. Hmm. Just not in her sister's case. Mm. Like somebody in the chat said they can't believe that she has six kids by him. Yeah, my ass. He probably got six kids himself. Yeah, he's got six kids around the rest of the city. Yeah, he oh. definitely her too. Oh, he's got more than that. He's right. got a baker's dozen at least. Her too. She and I'm sorry to say no disrespect, but she don't got one baby that Oh, absolutely not. I don't know. I don't know about that. I mean, like, she might, he might, she might be his, he might be her only baby. You, you see, I mean, you, that you see who she's into, Chief? Did you see the motherfucker she's she into? Has kids, though. So, like, she might have all her kids with that guy. With the yeah, guy but right the, there in, the, in the picture? The yeah, picture she no, has on with no. the, the yellow and black jacket is probably the best picture she's taken in her life because there's the other picture that they showed. She was looking kind of rough. Where, where is that? Oh, yeah. And you, you know, a chick's got um, some weight on her. Earlier in the story. Pictures. She's got some weight on her. She's taking pictures from above like that. Go a little forward. That one. Yeah. yeah she looks kind of ratchet there. Yeah. That's a little. That's a little yeah, no filters. No filters. <laughs> <laughs> she looks at him. He's charming. Uh, makes her feel hot. Yep. <laughs> Wet. Paid by the inches, man. Paid by the inch. Man. But she's gone now. I mean, like Mayo said, you know, lay in the dirt. Yeah, man. I feel bad for her family, man, because, I mean, the white family's upset about it. I, wonder what, I would love to hear what the black family has to say about it, man. Um, oh, they're going to throw a party for this motherfucker when he get home. The her black side of her family. Yeah, she's definitely mixed with something. Oh, yeah, she mixed with something. Well, they said she was, uh, she had her umbrito last name, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I think I heard her saying umbrito last name. She's, uh, I, yeah, but I, I don't think her, I, I don't think her. Too full to be umbrito, I think. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't think her and her sister have the same dad either. Yeah. No, they, I think they called Good her call. Ortiz Carter. Ortiz Good Carter. Call. Yeah. 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 They don't have the same father either. So they can't. I mean, this her features. Yeah. Yeah. This is generational. Yeah. But the fact that the fact that he's out is unacceptable. Let's be honest. Oh yeah. You know, I don't know if I don't know if Fourth. I heard it here, but they said you know he had a pending gun case. Are you surprised? So they they didn't they didn't they let him give him a bond on this one, but he has to pay I think five thousand for the gun case. So before he could be let out, 
That's all right. Danny, uh, Danny Glover and them, they'll, uh, they'll get him out. <laughs> right, right. Oh, no, no. Danny Glover right. and them got shut down. No, he, he going to need Meek Mill for this one. Well, he'll get, they'll, they'll slide him, they'll get him the money somewhere. No, they, 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 that, done, that thing's shut down because they're getting, they're getting sued. Good. Uh, yeah. If he, had I, a, I, if he had a pending gun case and a pending murder case, he should be without bond. I'm just sorry. That should be the way it is. Yeah, of course. No, ain't no doubt about he it. He didn't I get mean. a bond though. He didn't get a bond. He was released no. from the personal photography. No, yeah. but he no, he, he he got that one for the for the murder, but he got a bond for the gun case. I mm. so he, he Oh yeah. Yeah, so they they gave him the, the I bond for the for the murder, but he still got a five thousand bond for the gun. You know what I'm saying? They ought to be able to convict him on the gun case and keep him yeah. at this point, and then yeah. try him on the murder later. At this point, hit him hard for a gun. Go up, That's go usually what they do. Yeah. Yeah. You know? That's usually what they do. Yeah, and then, and then, 